Hi everyone and welcome to another trailer reaction and I'm reacting to something I'm most certainly not looking forward to. I mean yeah, I rarely actually react to things that I'm not interested in, but you do gotta do it once upon a time in a while, don't you? So I'm reacting to the teaser trailer of Live action How to Train Your Dragon, which I'm so not looking forward to like like this animated trilogy is perfection. This is literally the best animated trilogy ever. And yes, even better than Toy Story because Yep, in the past I was very much Team Toy Story, but after How to Train Your Dragon Free, The Hidden World, which I think is by far the best in the trilogy and a perfect ending. I'm very much strictly team How to Train Your Dragon now, ever, ever since then. And yes, I think that all three of those movies are perfect, with Free the Hidden World, as I just said, as the best. And I thought that if there ever is an animated movie that doesn't need a live action remake, in fact, I see almost no animated movie ever needs a live action remake, but How to Train Your Dragon certainly doesn't need one, just as all the Disney classics don't need one, and same way Cowboy Bebop didn't need one either. Like, I'm generally strictly the type of person that says you never know for sure until you give something a chance, and that if you have creators that truly care about what they're doing, then anything can work, but live action adaptations of animated, uh, of awesome animated movies is really where I draw a line, because... Like, animation often is actually part of the magic of those wonderful movies, and just remaking something live action basically strips all this magic. It's just like, basically, doing the same thing over again as was already done, while stripping large part of the magic, which is the animation. That's why, even though, as I always say, I generally believe that you never know if something for sure until you try something, I actually very much draw a line at live-action adaptations of awesome animated movies, and I know for a fact that this is not going to be good, but let's at least see this trailer to see really how bad it actually looks. Some will say that I'm already ready to just hate on this trailer. If you think that, go ahead. That's what you think, but I will try to judge it as objectively as I can. Toothless looks just like in an enemy. It's okay. I won't hurt you. Okay, can't say the trailer looks all terrible, as I said, I've given credit to admittedly pretty beautiful visuals and the landscapes, and honestly, I think the actor that plays Hiccup is actually a pretty good fit, like, not going to lie that I do think he he does kind of look the part, as well as his father's stoic, like, but at the same time, honestly, this just looks like the first movie over again, just with live action paint on it, like this literally looks like the very first movie, it literally looks like the same movie just with a different coat of paint and as I said, animation, a computer generated animation of this movie was part of the magic and now by making it in live action you basically strip all this magic and just retelling the same story that already been told and doesn't need to be told again, like make more original ideas and 
As for the design of Toothless, well, he looks exactly the same as he did in an animated movie. There is not any difference, except that in an animated movie everything was animated so it made perfect sense, like it fit perfectly, but here in live action he kind of looks out of place because of that, like... So, well, plenty of people will probably be happy that Toothless looks exactly the same, from an objective standpoint to me at least, he as a result kind of looks out of place in all this live action landscape. So, this basically confirms everything I've been saying even before seeing this trailer. This is just like literally looks like this very first movie over again, just with a live action paint on it, which makes me wonder like, at the very best, this will be just the same movie again, and in this case, why do we need it? And in the worst case scenario, it will just be a plain trash that's an insult to the original. Like, as I said in the beginning of the video, like, the How to Train Your Dragon trilogy is a perfect animated trilogy. Like, all three of those movies are amazing, perfect, and they certainly don't need a remake, a remake let alone a live action one. Like, jeez, why do they have to do this. On a while, we all know what Hollywood is capable of. And in fact, I might actually do the same thing I did when the live action Little Mermaid came out. I might just skip this altogether because if I want, then I'm basically further encouraging Hollywood to keep making those completely needless live-action remakes. Unless, how by some miracle, I hear good things. And then again, I wouldn't be surprised if critics will be just praising it because they cannot be trusted in the modern days anyways. But, yeah, I'm probably not actually saying this because we really need to start trying to send Hollywood a message that we are just tired of all those pointless live-action remakes of amazing animated movies that we already ha have. Like, start making original ideas, jeez. So, thank you all of you for checking out this trailer reaction and press the like button. Please subscribe to this channel and I will talk to you soon in another video. Talk to you soon, bye.